good looking. Join me for this indoor 5,000 step workout. That is right. We are going to aim for 5,000 steps, but we're just not marching on the spot for 40 minutes. I would not bore the hell out of you and do that to you. Instead, we're doing a variety of different movements to move the legs and the hips and get the glutes fired up while getting our step count in. So lace up your runners and let's go get started. Hello there and welcome. I'm PJ from fitnesswithpj.com and over50fitness.co. And if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you click that subscribe button so we can keep working together. If you're enjoying this ads free on the Over 50 Fitness app, make sure you head to our private community afterwards and let me know what you thought. All right, shall we begin? Excellent, okay, I want you to take one leg and tap it to the side and bring the arms up. That's right, no warm up. we're just moving right into it. This is all low impact, and as mentioned, we're trying to accumulate 5,000 steps. We have 15 different movement patterns in which I have our hips moving in all sorts of different directions, and then we do it again, and then we do it again. <laughs> At any time, feel free to march it on the spot and grab some water, but make sure you keep marching so we keep getting that step count in. When you step out, you have a slight bend in this knee, arms reaching up. If that bothers the shoulders, just go to shoulder height. Yeah, you got it. Last few seconds, we'll march it on the spot, and then this leg we're tapping out is going to come up into a knee up. So tap it for a few seconds. The same leg, we're going to come up and good. Bring the elbow across. Now, if you don't like to twist in the spine due to scoliosis or osteoporosis, you keep yourself upright. Otherwise, you will add a bit of a twist as the knee comes up. But the upper body stays upright, so we're not leaning forward. Good job. Now, is this an exact 5,000 count? No, it's not. <laughs> it is a rough estimate. We're aiming for four kilometers of movement total. I have my watch on to let us know. And four kilometers roughly equivalent, is the equivalent to 5,000 steps. But you can let me know below if you have a step counter on what your step count was. It actually might be higher. <laughs> Time. Now, before we do the other side, march it on the spot. Take yourself so that we can sink into a squat and give me some monster walks. Couple forward. Good, and couple back. Excellent. So we stay in that squat position, firing up the quads. Feet are shoulder width apart. It's a wide march. Again, I call these my monster walks. They're even more fun with a booty band on. <laughs> you might have done that workout I released last week. Fifty seconds here, and then we've got the other leg for that half jumping jack. Tie, march it out. Keep moving, don't stop. This side jack, go. Good, softness in this leg. Tap that leg out, you got it. Now, never in a million years, would I ever thought I would be doing a 5,000 step workout. <laughs> I have my friend Carly to thank for this, or maybe to kill for it. We'll see how it does on YouTube. <laughs> but it is a highly searched YouTube keyword, so, and I thought I could put my little flair to it. And I get it, right? Some of you live in environments where you just can't go outside and walk. All right, I'm lucky I live in Vancouver. As long as you have a good raincoat, you can go outside. Last three, two, one. Now march it out and then this same leg again. Remember, it's coming up a knee across and we'll add a twist, okay? But that twist is optional. Good. So reach it, reach it, reach it. Awesome. Knees coming up, not the upper body coming down to the knee. So we're gonna keep that pillar in the spine, nice and tall. Great job. 
two side steps are coming up. Now I have to admit too, I really had to put my thinking cap for this one. Because <laughs> again, I just didn't want to march in my living room for 40 minutes. Now I hope you have music on too on your end. We can't hear on YouTube, but I want you to have your tunes blaring, okay? Time, march it out. Give yourself some room. Laterally, laterally we're gonna take it two steps, two steps. Add those arms. If you sink it down deeper into a squat, you work a little harder, so you choose your intensity. Yes, please, blare your music. We don't play music on the channel because everybody's tastes are unique, and some people don't want to hear music. So this gives you the option to just listen to me or to play your own tunes on your end. Getting into the lateral hip here with this movement. Time, we march it, we come to the center. We're gonna tap back and arms come forward, go. So this is a little hip extension, opening up the hip flexor while we work the glutes. We add the arms, that increases the intensity. We're tapping out to the side again in 10 seconds. All right, now we tap out and we add the arms coming up now, okay? If that bothers the shoulders, you'll come in front. As I always say, don't sacrifice a body part to try and get the exercise in, okay? <laughs> Unless you want to send your physiotherapist or physical therapist to plan a trip to Hawaii. <laughs> I even shaved my armpits for this workout. Uh-huh. You're welcome. See what would you what you would miss if I had music on instead of me talking? <laughs> Now we have a repeater knee coming up. You'll mirror me, so it's gonna be your right knee coming up. We march it out. All right, we tap back with this leg and we add the arms, pull them down, good. The leg that stays on the ground, the knee is bent. Reach it, pull it, squeeze the shoulder blades, work through your lats and your shoulders as well. Ooh, you're gonna feel the glute on this stabilizing leg. No doubt about it. <laughs> maybe even your calf, <laughs> or maybe just the whole damn leg. <laughs> now we have 12 seconds here. We're gonna continue on leading with this right knee or right leg of yours for a V step. Time, march it out, all right. If you ever did aerobics, you know this step, V and back. Lead with the same leg, good. Add the arms, pump them. Sink down to that squat if you wanna make it harder. But you're traveling, you're making that letter V, yes? Good. V for victory. Thirty more seconds and then repeat her knee with that other leg. Man, is this bringing me back to the early 90s when I used to teach aerobics. Holy cow. <laughs> I just had a wave of nostalgia crash over me. <laughs> and you're going to go, woo! Yeah, that was me. That was me, man, totally. 
I wooed, I jumped, I wore leg warmers, time, march it out. Actually, the 80s, I wore leg warmers. Go, repeat her knee, whoop, add the arms, pull them down. And here I am, 30 years later, doing it again. Woo. Once again, it's that leg that's staying on the ground that you're going to feel the most. I love the repeater knee. If you've been in my workouts before, you know this one always shows up for all of our low impact workouts because it's so effective working that leg and getting the heart rate up and being kind to our joints. Woo. V step leading with this leg coming up. Time, holy moly. Give it a little, a little slap. Go. Yeah, if you want to go, woo, you go for it. <laughs> Add a little bit of that squat. Good job. Yeah, we're doing good. We're doing very good. So again, I've got my Apple Watch on. And I've got the indoor walk setting on. Now it doesn't give me a step count, but what it does is give me kilometers. So our goal is four kilometers because I Googled that shit and apparently 5,000 steps is four kilometers. I have no idea how my peers do it on YouTube because there's a ton of 5,000 step workouts. But that's how I'm doing it, time. All right, we're tapping, we're jabbing, arms come back in and go. And I also noticed with my peers, the workouts range from 23 minutes all the way to one hour. So, I don't know. Ours is going to be just over 40. So when we jab, we're bringing the elbow back in, okay? In the boxing world, it's protecting your side, your rib cage, and then the other hand comes back to your chin because you're protecting the chin. All right, thumb over the hand. Knuckles are even to me when you give me that jab, and you're placing the arm. You're just not throwing it. You be good. You be deliberate with your punch. Excellent. Side to side legs in three, two, one, and it's side to side. We're going to add those arms. Oh my goodness, this is another flashback. <laughs> I didn't teach a lot of aerobics, but what I did teach a ton of were step classes. This was one of our warm ups with our step in front of us. <laughs> it was fun. And I couldn't afford a step back then, it's just starting out. So I would use a dish towel, and that was my step. I remember we were living in a basement suite and I would get loving husband to be my participant and I would lead him through a workout and both of us had our dish towels, those were our steps. Because <laughs> step is very dancey, I'm not dancey. You need to be on the beat, in the phrasing. If you're an instructor, you know what I'm talking about. If you're in music, you know what I'm talking about. So, and that doesn't come naturally to me. <laughs> Time, we march it wide. We have some hamstring curls. It goes single, single, double, single. Single, now add the arms, double it up, go. Single, single, double it up, right here. You got it, come on. So those are our moves. We're taking it back to that single leg jacks coming up. Anyways, loving husband was a good sport. He's always been a good sport. But I practice, man, anything I do, I want, to, I want to be the best. <laughs> Wish I was okay with mediocre. <laughs> it would make my life easier. <sighs> single, single, double, march it out. All right, you're mirroring me. We've got single leg jacks. This leg taps out, go.
That was 30 years ago, that little story I just told you. <laughs> I remember when I finally could afford to buy a step. Woo! I bought a step and a stability ball. Man, I thought... I thought I was the cat's meow. <laughs> March it out. This leg's coming up for the knee up. All right, we're bringing that arm across. Ready, go. Hup. Now you bring that arm down, kind of like a John Travolta staying alive. Oh, now that's going to go through our head, isn't it? Sorry about that. <laughs> was he like this? Yeah, he was. <laughs> Come on, I gotta have a little fun here in my living room. <laughs> Join me with the fun. Ready, we're gonna do John Travolta, go, hold. Oh, good, thanks for playing. All right, monster walks are coming up. Woo. This is kind of like a repeater knee, isn't it? Man, I snuck that in, didn't I? <laughs> snuck two of them in. Time. Give yourself some room in front. We want two big steps. Sink it, step it, go. One. One. I got three in. One, two, three. One. Woo! Sink it deeper. Work those quads. Yes. My heart rate is getting up there too. Actually, <laughs> this little 5,000 step workout is going to give us a really good calorie burn. You better give this sucker a thumbs up when you're done. <laughs> Time, march it out. Woo! Get yourself centered. Other leg jacks, go. And remember, arms can come here, right? And that's also another way to bring the intensity down. If you're like, PJ, I clicked on this because it said 5,000 steps. 5,000 steps like a normal person, not like a gladiator. All right, so you choose your level. Whew. Working the lateral hip here. Boy, do you feel that leg there? Oh, goodness me. Isn't that awesome? I love it. I love the burn. Come on, embrace the burn. Time, march it out, march it out. All right, John Travolta's coming up. Other side, ready? Hup, hup, hup. Again, don't twist. If you have issues like scoliosis of the spine, osteoporosis, okay. Two side steps coming up in less than 30 seconds. Now I wonder how this watch works for step, like I don't get it. Do I need to be moving the arm that my watch is on to make sure that it shows that we're doing a step? Who knows? Again, if you're wearing a pedometer, please let me know what your step count was. I'd love to hear it. Time, woo, baby. All right, we're stepping side, ready? Side, side, add the arms. Sink down if you wanna make it harder. And if you have music on, hopefully it's something upbeat and maybe the tempo is driving you to go a little faster. Yeah. 
Nothing slow. Don't play anything slow. Tap back, coming up. Woo! All right. We tap it, we press it. Both arms, let's go. Just the toe taps. Good. You got to slightly lean forward with the upper body, yes? Yes, good. Keep those arms going, come on. Ten more seconds. Working glutes here. This is a really good move. Time. March it out. We're going to tap it and reach it up and over. Ready? It goes tap, tap, tap. Nice length of the body. Dynamic stretch of the side of the body as we reach up. Keep your torso upright. Not leaning forward. Great job, you. Now, the Fitness with PJ headquarters right now, just off to my left, I have a dog crashed on the bench, upstairs on the master bed, I have another shepherd, he is crashed on the bed, in the spare bedroom on the queen size bed, I have a cat crashed. Yeah. If you want to be reincarnated, be reincarnated as one of my pets. They truly live the best life. <laughs> March it out. I work to keep them in the lifestyle they're used to. Repeat her knee, mirror me, arms up, go. Are you the same? <laughs> I don't know what I would do if I didn't have pets. First off, I would be deemed crazy because I'm, I always talk to them. So if they're not here, I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> That's just batshit crazy. But if dog's here, I'm just talking to them. We're having a conversation. George and I always have a conversation. He just looks at me the entire time. He's a good boy that way. Woo! All right. Keep that chest up. You're bringing the knee up, yes? Good. V-step coming up. Keep those arms going. Come on. March it out. You want some room in front of you? You step it, same leg that was doing the knee up. Good, sink down to that squat if you want. Add the arms. How are we doing for, oh, we are rocking this. We are actually going to be above 5,000 steps. Yes. I am so proud of us. I am, I really am. <laughs> Repeat her knee, other leg coming up. About 10 seconds. Good. March it out. Whew. Remember, arms up, tap this leg back, and go. Chest lifted still? Okay, just thought I'd check in with you. As we get tired, it's really easy to lose the spine, lose the posture. So I just like to give a little coaching cue every so often. A gentle nudge your way. <laughs> Woo, baby, come on. V-step coming up, time. March it out, have some room. That knee that was coming up, that steps forward first. Add the arms. Come on. Add that squat if you want when you come out. Squat. 
Good. Back when I used to teach step two, there was one gym that I taught at, huge gymnasium. We were on a full stage, mic, the whole bit. And my class was packed. And a loving husband came in. And I told all the ladies, because it's usually women who go to step classes, everybody, and I used to call him a loving husband back then too, <laughs> wave to loving husband. <laughs> oh my goodness, he'd go beat red. I know, I don't know why he stayed married to me or why he kept coming to my classes. <laughs> Tap out, jab, go. <laughs> and then if he had to leave early because he worked just down the road, and uh, everybody wave to loving husband, he's going. <laughs> oh. Here we go, we're taking Fitness with PJ down memory lane. Fitness with PJ existed back then too. Back then it was her. <laughs> in her green car, driving around with that step I was telling you about, and her stability ball and a couple pairs of dumbbells to people's homes. Well, I taught, oh gosh, I don't know, 20, 30 step classes a week. <laughs> Good, remember that jab, right? We're placing the arm, we're not flinging it. Woo, all right. We tap each side and we reach up, 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 good, up and up, one at a time. You got it, good. Hamstring curl, single, single, double is our last move of the series and then we move into our final round. I hope. We may have to march it for a little longer, make sure we hit that 4K mark. <laughs> You didn't expect me to actually count 5,000 steps, did you? <laughs> Have you seen me try to count to three? Uh-huh, it's painful. <laughs> I can't teach and count. <laughs> it's either one or the other. You can't have both. <laughs> Time. All right, march it wide for me. All right, get set up for that hamstring curl. Ready, add the arms. It's a single, a single double here. Good, heel to bum, knees stay underneath the hips. Working into hamstrings, good. Single, single, double up, baby. Yes. Double up. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. We're taking it from the top in 30 seconds. I think I just added an extra double. Oh well. March it on the spot. All right, single leg jacks, ready, set, go. Same leg, let's go. Knee up with that twist if you want. Twist is optional. Coming up next. Where do you want those arms if you're getting tired, if the shoulders are bothering you? Yeah. Where do you want those legs? Exactly what you're doing now. <laughs> no modification for that. You keep moving those legs, girlfriend or boyfriend. People, move the legs, people. Time. All right. Feet just hip width, here we go. We bring the knee and cross, cross. Good, now add John Travolta, here we go. Except I think he had the front leg bent like this, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I think that's how it is. I can see the poster in my mind's eye. White suit, big collar. Now, if you don't know who John Travolta is, or if you don't know staying alive, <laughs> you're on the wrong workout. <laughs> this is for those of us over the age of 40. 
Just joking. We allow the young ones in. They just got to put up with my sad dad jokes. Time. That was getting tiring. All right, monster walks. Here we go. Sink it. Oh, no. My mat's crooked. Here we go. Goes three, two, one feet. Three, two, one feet lined up and move it. Now, if you're getting tired, lift more out of that squat. I know my thighs are burning. <laughs> Whew. 50 seconds is a long bloody time on that move. Who designed this stupid workout? All right, jacket, ready, go. Now the other leg. <laughs> we need to complain to management. <laughs> thighs are burning. When I owned a physical studio, the garbage can, <laughs> we had a big sign on the garbage can that said complaints department. <laughs> you gotta have a sense of humor, right? You gotta have a sense of humor. <laughs> Woo boy. John Travolta, other knee coming up in five, four, three, Two, march it, shake it. All right, so let's start with the knee coming up and add a bit of a twist, and then we can John Travolta it if we want to. Oh, poor John. Poor John, actually, yeah. I think he lost his son and his wife in the same year, or if not, same two years. That is rough, man. Remember, I lost my dad. Didn't lose him, he died. I know where he went. <laughs> my dog, oh, in the course of three months, back when I was in my 30s. That was rough. Yeah, I don't quite understand that I lost him. I didn't lose him. They died. I know where they are. <laughs> All right, this is getting morbid. I'm moving on with the conversation. Time. Woo! <laughs> Two side steps. This is what happens when <laughs> you got 41 minutes. <laughs> All right, now, remember, you're getting tired, step it up, right? I mean, lift it up, not necessarily step it up. Lift it up, you're not so weight bearing on the quads. <sighs> Good. Opposite effect, if you're finding, hey, PJ, I want to ramp my heart rate up here for the last little bit. There you go, sink it down lower. Tap back with arms lifting up in five, three, two, one. In the middle of your mat, we tap back, we press forward. Let's go. How are we doing for time? Oh, someone just messaged me. Stop it! I need to see my watch. Now, <laughs> to add insult to injury, my dog here, Bella Girl, who's lying there, I'll take, if she's still there when we're done, I'll film her, but she's snoring now. <laughs> like I said, they have a good life. Time, woo! All right, we tap it, we reach it. Ready, set, go. Little side bend. Good. Remember, 
Repeat her knee. Oh, my personal fave coming up in 30 seconds. March it out. Now remember, you're mirroring me, so this knee's coming up. Arm start up, tap back, go. Keep that chest lifted. Nice job. So the knee's coming to meet the hands. That means that you've got to lift that knee high, okay? It's not the hands to the knee. Big difference in intensity. The leg that's not moving, that guy stays bent. Woo, baby. Third round's the charm, man. Holy cow. 15 seconds, V step coming up. One more knee, march it out. All right, this leg V-step, you ready? Let's add those arms, go. Now, if your step count doesn't say 5,000 steps, if it says less, it's fine, man. We worked out for 41 minutes. <laughs> Don't be the step Nazi, okay? <laughs> Again, I don't know how my peers do it on YouTube. And then I think they count each individual step. I'm not going to make my video editor do that. We're going for 4K. That's what Google says is 5,000 steps time. So that's what we're doing. And we're going to finish. We're going to finish and feel amazing, okay? You're definitely gonna get a good little sweat happening, a nice glow. And then as mentioned, I wanted to make sure I gave you movements that take the hips in the 360 degree plane that they move in. So this is actually better than walking because walking is very linear. You're only moving forward. We're never getting the side of the hip fired up. Here, we're putting emphasis on outer hip, on your glutes, on your hamstrings, as well as the quads and hip flexors. Plus, you can't just randomly do John Travolta out on the street, or maybe you can. Let's try it. <laughs> if you can, you're my kind of person. <laughs> Time. <laughs> All right, V-step this leg. Let's go. <laughs> it's a random John Travolta down aisle eight of thirsty foods. <laughs> I got to admit, I am working harder than I thought I was going to. My heart rate, I don't know if this is correct, but it's at 140. This is my heart rate when I go for a run. This is awesome. Why haven't I done this kind of workout before? We'll blame it on Carly. She didn't tell me to do it before. It's all her fault. Time. All right, tap out jabs. Remember, be strong with the arms. Go. It's all Carly's fault. Now, if you're wondering who is this Carly person, <laughs> she's the other half of fitness with PJ and over 50 fitness. If it wasn't for her, yeah, I'd be a raving alcoholic. <laughs> she takes care of a lot of stuff and men wise, <laughs> social media wise, graphics. <laughs> Ooh, baby. Yes. 
So now we're getting that lateral hip I was talking about, okay? That outer hip that we don't engage when we're walking. Nice, huh? All right. We're going to tap it side to side. Add those arms. Ready, set, go. Be strong with those arms. Good job. Oh yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. Hamstring curls are next. Single, single, double. Dive, whoo. All right, feet apart, single, single, double. You ready, go. Single, single, double it up. Heel to bum, knee underneath the hip. Yes, yes. Baby. All right, we just got to add a little bit of random movement here just to keep us going. All right, we rope climb, rope climb, rope climb. So we're climbing the arms up, knees drive up. Just a couple. All right. <laughs> we got to hit that four kilometers on my watch. Come on. Add the arms, add those knees. Nicely done. baby. Time. Oh, we're almost there. All right. Alternating step out side to side lunges. Good. Now you bend that knee as much as you want. All right. So this leg that's stepping out, that's the one that bends. Knees track towards me. Good. This is it. We finish this and we grab some water, we stretch, and you can continue on with your day. I really wanna thank you for joining me. One more, last one, time. Yes, baby, woohoo! I'm just gonna push stop on my timer. Keep moving the feet, because who knows, maybe we can hit 4.10 kilometers. Woo. Grab water if you need it, I'm gonna grab some. It was a pleasure training you today. Thank you for showing up. I am always impressed that of people that come find my workouts on YouTube and you know self-motivate you, self-motivate themselves to get the job done in your living room or in your space in your home. That's hard to do, so bravo to you, bravo. Woo, all right. So, you wanna do some stretches? I think we should. Let's have the feet apart for me. Step back with one foot, foot in a straight line. Good, press the back of the knee to the wall behind you. You've got your shoulder, hip, and heel in a bit of a straight line here. This is gonna give you a nice stretch in the calf, which worked a lot in this workout. Now take this arm across, thumb up, and press in. 
Now, let's be honest, it would probably have been easier for you to go outside and walk 5,000 steps. This was a tough little 5,000 step workout. <laughs> I am really proud of us. I really hope you had some good music. And I hope you favorite this video and do it again in the future. If you do, you have to have Staying Alive. You got to have the Bee Gees on, on your playlist. You just got to. All right, heel to the bum. <laughs> Pull back, squeeze the bum forward. And again, if you're wondering who are the Bee Gees, well, thank you for showing up to my workout. <laughs> I remember my sister having posters of the Bee Gees in her bedroom. I had posters of Luke Skywalker. <laughs> All right, other side. Heel to the bum, or sorry, heel in a straight line in the foot, back leg straight, good. Other arm across, stretch into the arms and shoulder a bit, because they did get some good work with this. Release, heel to bum. We'll just do a few stretches. If you want to do more stretches, I'll link up something at the very end of this video, which is a little bit more um, in depth for your stretch. But uh, we're just going to hit the major players. All right, hips, quads, and hamstrings. And then you can continue on with your day. Or if you've got extra time, play that extended stretch session that'll be floating across your screen if you're on YouTube. And for over 50 fitness, I want you to head to either our stretch playlist or our yoga playlist and check out the hundreds of videos we have there and choose something there. Release. All right. Knee to the ground. Good. Knee underneath the hip. Now contract that glute. Front knee and ankle lined up. Inhale this arm straight up. Exhale. Lean away. Circle this arm behind, nice and slow. Straighten your front leg, toe up, hinge forward, Woo, stretch into the hammies. And come on up, other side. So knee under hips, squeeze that bum. You'll get more of a stretch if we contract the opposing muscle group. You want to feel the release in the front of your hip, your hip flexor. Now reach the arm straight up and lean away. For those of you on YouTube, um, YouTube, you know, put, puts ads in all of the workouts. So this workout was interrupted a couple of times with ads. So if ads bother you, hey, head on over to the Over 50 Fitness ad app. We have all my YouTube workouts there, as well as workouts from eight other amazing instructors. And there's a free 14-day trial down in the description. Circle the arm behind nice and slow. Straighten that front leg, chest over thigh. Woo! Stretch out that hamstring. And slowly come on up. And you did it! Thank you so much for joining me once again. Click subscribe if you haven't already done so on YouTube, and please drop a comment below. I would love to know what you thought of the workout. Have a great rest of your day. Bye. Hey, want to see Bella? <laughs>